my music definitely um it gives you a time period of it's not just it's not just a bunch of words that's fitting on a beat i'm telling you about my life how it's happening from the struggles from the ups from the downs from the back blocks to the trenches to the hills when we get there that's a fact you know that's I mean? a fact so I with that. I'm just trying to inspire others, like you feel me. Just trying to inspire the world. Sit, we doing this on an inspirational, motivational tip. Talk to him. Fuck with that. I can feel that energy when you, when you're on. Are you are you more of a freestyler? You said you started out freestyling, right? Started out with the freestyling. And then now, do you find it harder to to like like say at the 16 bars? Did you find it harder to drop those bars there? or to drop bars that you already written and get to a performance? Nah, um, for me, I could move in and out of it. I could adapt. So like, if it's a cypher, it could be a cypher. If I gotta write a song, I know how to set my mind to do that also. So kind of over, all around with it type. All right, fuck it up. How long does it normally take you to write a song? Um, two days. Sir? Sir, is that is that valid? And I want to ask you, uh -oh. what's your top five, dead or alive? My top five, dead or alive, dead, that's a tricky question. Um, in no specific order. Nope. Nope. Jada Kiss. Ooh, there we go. <laughs> um, DMX. Okay. Talk to him. Um, Jay-Z. Is that three, right? Yeah. Damn, this 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 shit is so good. Yeah, it's always the last two, bro. It's always the last two for everybody. Speak. Little Wayne. Ooh, okay. And and that last one. Big Al. Ah. Wait, why you hit the button? Oh, just because it was the last one. No, don't, don't. I'm not trying to think about it. Big L. See, that's interesting. Big L. That's interesting, because his top five, there's only one out of town that was Lil Wayne. Everybody else was like homegrown, and Big L is a big, big, big influence. And especially. That, it, it's fucked up, because like, I got KRS-One on that list, Big mm. Daddy Kane on that mm. list, Slick Rick on that list, mm. feel me? Jungle Brothers is on that list. MCs, damn. Like, yeah. So that's that's a, shit, I hate that question. I know, I know, I know. It's the it's squeezing the top five because everybody I think everybody has been here since we started asking that question hates that question because it makes you they will spit out their top five, but they got like another 20. And then we have one artist who, <laughs> <laughs> What? <laughs> now I know what you're gonna say. He squeezed it. He, who you talking about? My guy who came the other week, right? Yeah, he came the other week. We told him top five. He gave us five. Niggas said, fuck this shit. Gave us five more. Yeah, he just squeezed his whole top ten. <laughs> he, in. he did a top ten on his own. <laughs> his double like Niggas said, no, fuck that. Because you're not going to leave out such and such and such. And then this person yeah. and that person. And we was like, all right. All right. All right. All right. 